Hello, little children. I'm going to be reading this book today. I'm not just a scribble. I'm not just a scribble. Written and illustrated by Dan Elber. To my children, Ryan and Anna. Great art starts with just a scribble. This story is about a scribble whose lines would cross and wiggle. Tiny loops would start him small. Bigger swirls would make him tall. He could be shades of green or baby blue. Even crazy colors. He loved them too. Choosing bright colors made him feel free. You never knew which one he would be. Then one day... Scribble took a short walk where he found a house and stopped to talk. Hello, said Scribble. It's such a great day. I thought I'd come over and we could all play. The house never saw anything like Scribble before, but he was curious enough to find out a bit more. So even though he was grumpy and didn't want to play, he still managed to grunt. What are you anyway? Scribble was confused and didn't know what to say, so he said to the house, I'm just a scribble. Is that okay? It's not okay, said the big mean house. You don't look right, your lines aren't straight, and your colors are too bright. But color is fun, Scribble said. I can show you why, just give me a chance. Please, let me try. No, said the house. You cannot stay. You're nothing like me. Now go away. Hearing those words made Scribble feel so sad. A tear ran down his face and he felt really bad. But I won't be upset. He proclaimed that day, so he changed his colors and went on his way. He continued his walk and soon found the sun. Along with the clouds, they could all have some fun. But the sun saw him coming and told him to stop. Your lines are too messy and we don't have a mop. Turn around, little scribble. He went away to say, go back to your home. Please just go away. But you're not being nice, scribble shouted quite mad. The fact that I'm different doesn't make me so bad. My colors are special and my lines are just fine. If you'd give me a chance, we could have a great time. Did we ask him to say? They huddled to discuss. It's fun with more friends. It's usually just us. And although they were worried this wouldn't work out, being mean to Scribble wasn't what they were all about. Scribble was surprised at what he saw next day. All the drawings were there, and they wanted to play. Even Rainbow showed up, and he never came by. He was standing right there, near the sun, in the sky. We're so sorry, said the clouds as they held back their tears. Please come play, said the house. We haven't had fun in years. I forgive you, Scribble shouted as he did a happy dance. They were so grateful he gave them another chance. Scribble gathered up his colors and played with everyone. Blue, purple, green, and yellow. It was all so much fun. Look at what they finally created when they came together. The art was so beautiful and it was better than ever. The book came with stickers that you could okay, do art with. I'm not just a scribble. And this was for kindergartners, first graders, and uh, pre-K. So, yeah, this is a short book. And if you buy the actual book, you get free stickers. Oh, you might not be able to see it, but that has free stickers. Okay, goodbye.